believed that the depiction of black history taught in schools and printed in textbooks was so grossly misrepresented until he thought it was necessary to designate a special week to focus on black history. It was initially called Negro History Week, which lasted from 1926 until 1975. It evolved into Black History Month in 1976. Pebblebrook High School has produced the African American Heritage Month program for eight years. This was the last of the four shows that we have performed today. Our program opened with an arrangement of Kumbaya made popular by the Soweto Gospel Choir. The program included over 180 students performing a variety of acts pertaining to African American history, including vocal music, drama, dance, and poetry. We had three salutes to notable African Americans this year. The show displayed the evolution of many topics such as step to tap to contemporary dance, gospel a cappella music to contemporary a cappella music, spirituals to classical music, and traditional oratory to original spoken word. This is a great program for our school and our community. It's an opportunity to showcase the talent of not only our students in the performing arts program, but the general Pebble Brook population. Being a part of the uh, performing arts magnet program here at Pebble Brook High School is, is such an awesome thing, and we get to do uh, performances like the Black History Month program, and um, it's an awesome time to perform our, for our peers on this really important subject that we need to be reminded of. Um, and it's so great we do this every year. I'm a lot of behind the scenes. I do a lot of background work uh, with the music and making sure that uh, everything is together. We put a lot of music with the students. We do a lot of live performances. And I work with the uh, other uh, staff, uh, faculty, uh, musicians here at the school. Uh, as the band director, I also work with the jazz band, which also is an integral part uh, of the African American History Month program. This is my eighth year. Uh, doing this program and the jazz band has been a part of this program as long as I've been here. It's a wonderful opportunity uh, to share with the school and with the community you know the contributions of African Americans to society and that's what this program is all about. We're very happy to be putting this on every year. I was a part of you know several different pieces and that was really cool because I was able to help others understand and learn about black history with singing and I was a part of this preaching piece where they discuss like the importance of black preachers and how that movement and how it's still you know helping us. For me it's always rewarding but the process is a very challenging experience uh, because it has so many parts. We include everything from JROTC to our dance department, the costume department is involved, vocal drama. We try to involve anyone that is in, interested, including the whole school. Our finale commemorated the march from Selma to Montgomery. We recognized the contributions to civil rights in 1965, while also supporting the nonviolent protest of today. We hope to gain knowledge and appreciation of African-American history through the performing arts. This